So, ayan. Bago natin puntahan ang main house, I will tour you around muna dun sa perimeter ng ating um, building. So, come on. Let's go. Bukas ba to, Lex? Bukas yan. <laughs> Ay? Sarado, Sarado ulit. ulit. <laughs> Hi amigas, it's Architect Carla and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So for today's episode, samahan niyo ako at itutur ko kayo inside a two-story residential building dito sa Ayala, Alabang Village. O ayan, di ba? Bongga ang pagbabalik ng ating katok ni Kitek episode. Siyempre, sa mga hindi pa po nakakapag-subscribe sa aking YouTube channel, please subscribe Carla Malabed. At siyempre, don't forget to hit the notification bell button para lagi kayong updated sa aking mga i-upload na videos. So, ano pang inaantay natin? Tara! Pero bago natin pasukin ang main door, dito muna tayo sa perimeter para isang ikot na lang tayo. So, let's go! So, this is the right side perimeter ng bahay. Ayan. So, so medyo ano pa siya, medyo messy pa kasi still under construction, pero makikita nyo dito on the perimeter, they have itong parang trash, ano matagal, trash room. Yeah, trash room. Dito nila nilalagay yung mga trashes from inside ng bahay, tapos dito yung tambahan. O, oh, diba bongga mayaman? May mayaman. Ano? Pwede ko nang tulugan, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is parang service area, yung mga laundry, um, service, uh, atang ito, basta yung mga utility, utility area nila. Dito sila magsasampay and everything. So, ito muna yung pinasok natin. Then, landscape around the house. So, kasama sa landscape yung sun. <laughs> so, ayan. Oh, yan. Hanggang dyan ka lang. Um, this perimeter is leading to the yeah, dirty, kitchen. dirty kitchen. At saka doon sa kabilang side is the pool area. Mamaya isa-surprise ko kayo kung ano, magiging, kung ano yung itsura ng pool area. Side. Ito natin yung architect nito. Hi! So, ayan. Hi! This is architect Mel Almanzor. She's the architect and owner of this two-story house in Alabang. So, let's go inside. So, architect Mel will explain to us yung features ng bahay na to. So, let's start with the foyer. Okay. <clears throat> what a lot of people don't realize uh, is in... In general, most people put their electrical panels in their pantries. Here we put it close to the main door, but try our best to hide it using cladding. Because what people don't realize, the closer your electrical panels mm -hmm. are to the electrical entrance, the savings you will get from the wiring. Uh -huh. So that's a good design tip. Yeah. So double purpose, yeah, storage and utility areas. Okay. Ano ginamit mo dito sa We use plywood and Russian pine for okay. the cladding. This main door is a mix of mahogany and kamagong. Ah, mahogany and kamagong. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then metal handles. Yeah. Alright. And then, and then we enter. Flooring. Oops. Apan yung entrance lang dito yung um, stairs going siya to the second floor and the third floor. So we have a door here. Yes. Well, as we all know, this is the time of pandemic. A lot of people now like to have mud rooms yeah so before you enter the rest of the house you like to put all of your shoes clothes jackets yes. jackets bags keep so it's the dirty uh -oh. ppes yan kung galing ka sa tabahan ng mga ppes jackets they're not loaded here yeah so okay parang american style yes yung mga jackets and ano nandiyan and try to hide it yeah so and then powder room so, we'll take, natin yung mga powder rooms. Yeah, you'll take notice we like hexagons in this house. Oh, nga, yeah. And this room is the office. The office. So, meron siya office then on the ground floor. Mm -hmm. So, overlooking the um, dark off end parking area. Wow. Yeah. Very nice. Also, the no holiday Ah, mahogany yung floor niya. So, good, good and floor siya. Mm -hmm. So, ito yung pinakalibig area niya. And dining area. So, open, open, open na lang siya. Um, so, yung high ceiling. Narrow ceiling, actually. Ah, so this one is narrow na lang. Yellow narrow. Same as the one above. Uh -huh. Ah, that's nice. Narrow rin siya. Same as this. Uh -huh. So, ito, this one. So, now, 
Let's proceed to the main kitchen. So our showcase kitchen also has solid nara for the bar. Mm -hmm. If you want to do exhibition cooking yeah. or whatever. Uh -huh. um, we also have matching nara on our ceiling, same as in the living room and dining room. There are different shades of varying now. They have yung modular kitchen cabinets. So, yan. Continuing the theme with hexagons and mm -hmm. the flashboards. Very nice po. So, they have this um, sink. Ano tawag sa sink na to, Mel? Farm style sink. Farm style sink. Oh, nice. Very nice. Then, mga drawers for kitchen yeah. utensils. Very nice. Then, El Barren. Mm -hmm. El Bakuk Pak and Rain Shoot. They have patchy cabinets. Yeah. And tandem microwave and oven. Microwave by El Baden. No? So, sa mga mahilig mag-bake at saka magluto-luto. Yan. Yeah. Nice. I guess if you want to vlog cooking, you can do that here. Oh, ah, yeah. Pag nabili ko na to. <laughs> and then, we have Siyempre, we have, eto baka nagtatanong si Hawaii, bakit masyado malaki? Ah, uh, this was designed if you wanted to buy the tandem refrigerator and freezer mm -hmm. tandem. So, malaki siya, mapipilitan kang bumali ito talaga ng malaking ref for ano, freezer and ref tandem. So, here okay. is the dirty kitchen or your secondary kitchen. This one pa pala muna, they have parang separate pantry pa. Yan. So, yan. Lagyan ng mga stocks. Siyempre, kailangan namin pa yung rice, delata, spam, and everything. Yan. So, here's the dirty kitchen. So, dirty na sa kanila to. <laughs> so, still under construction. So, may mga retouching. Retouching pa. Oo, punch listing pa yan. So, basically, here's the ground floor of the house. So, yan. Siyempre, meron din sink. Menong provision for the range food, the range and the oven, yeah. and, and the maid's room. Pwede na ako mag-apply ng maids. <laughs> Meron ako sariling for our walk-in. Siyempre, sariling CR. Toilet and bath. Very nice. Saan takin natin ayun niya? Nang, ang bakit ko all this? Maid's room. Siyempre, siguro mga dapat dalawa tatlong yaging ka rito, di ba? Yeah. So, ayan. So, ito may shower siya. And then... Here's the pool area! O, oh, di ba? Ang bongga ng pool area. Makikita niya ni Alex. O, oh, parang yung Tina Falls. Oh, diba? Nakapamay pool. So, ito, meron siyang access dun sa open area ng living and dining. So, overlooking yung pool area. Dito ko na yung alam, Itong platform na to. Very nice, no? Ang ganda. Ayun lang ba yan? From here, here na. Oo. Oh. Okay. Ito ang natural swimming area. Ang hard air. Ito lang. Ito lang. So, this is, the, this is the part of the pool area. Pero yun, mayroon pa siyang provisions to put mga lounge tables and chairs. Yan. So, para, you know, magkakainan, magkikisaan yan. So, that's the perfect area for mga barkadahan. So. Yes. And then, guest room. So, ang mga guest room is outside. So, this could be a guest room, this could be a theater. Yeah. So, this is the guest room. Yeah. This is the guest room. Shower area. 
O, di ba? Very nice. Parang, ang dami mo mga nakikita shapes dito, no? Different shapes. More on geomet geometrical shapes. So, there you go. Let's see kung ano ang meron sa taas. Come on!